Hey, you guys. Um, this is my season premiere of my videos. So, how are all of you guys doing? I hope you had all of you guys had a nice summer off and summer vacations or uh, whatever. So anyways, I'm just sitting here, lying down, relaxing in Mammoth. It's a gorgeous view. Yeah, gorgeous view outside. Looking at the mountains. But it's very windy out today. So anyways, I had a nice summer. Um, let me think. Um, I went to um, Mammoth couple of times to enjoy up here in Mammoth so I don't have to have a fucking heat <laughs> at the heatness because I don't like the heat where I live in Southern California. It was just so goddamn hot this year. Yeah, so damn hot this year. So anyways, um, I had a nice summer this year. I stayed up here a couple of times in Mammoth. And then I went to um, Long Beach with my mom, my mother. And then... Um, That's about it. Mostly here in Mammoth and um, in Long Beach. So not very much this year. Just uh, here and relaxing. So um, anyways, um, let me um, talk to you all of you guys about my summer movies I do recommend and that is um Maxine Maxine it came out in um June it's a horror movie from the 80s it connects with um Oh, jeez. Uh, what was that movie? Um, it's, uh, um, shit. Um, what is that movie connects to? I forgot what movie it was, but it connects of three stories to it. And um, the other movie I do recommend is um, called Horizons. It's with Kevin Costner. It's part one. And that came out in July. So last month. And um, the other movie I do recommend is called Sight. It's, um, with, um, Gray Kinnear and I forgot this other actor's name. It's a story all about Sight and the doctor of his life story. He used to grow up in either India or... Asia, I can't remember, either India or Asia, so that's, so I recommend that, and um, 
Also, I do recommend too to go see is Mad Max. That came out back in late May, and um, I forgot the actress's name, but um, she plays who shall um. I can't remember her name either, but she plays she plays her in the younger form. And um also Chris has a work is in it too as a bad guy. A bad villain. The <laughs> the guy from Thor. But um to be frank He's really good in this movie, Chris, as a, a villain. And um, what's weird is he has a beard, a thick beard, <laughs> which it reminds me of Gandalf Wizard from the Harry Potter movies and Lord of the Rings movies. <laughs> Um, so anyways, um, so yeah, uh, that's it for, um, my movies I do recommend for you guys, and plus, like I said, I had a great summer this year, and, um, that's it, so, um, I will see you all of you guys in 24 hours from now. Bye.